All right. No, I don't want to. Don't try that again. All right. So let's. Ah, uh, don't do this to me, game. I just loaded it, and already the FPS is. Let's fast forward that a bit. Oh, books. Oh, with luxury apartments on top. Well, I'm not gonna turn that down. Um. I guess this will be kind of like the horrible sector. And because this game is broken, All right, how much den am I in now? Still, 216, all right. <clears throat> but the good news is, this will be all Free land to play with. <clears throat> well, I will maybe buy more later. Um, do that. Maybe we can help with a. Highway. Like, I like these ideas, but I don't have the money to do this. <coughs> Sorry, guys. Sixty thousand. I'm just trying to get out of debt. I'm just trying to... It's like 174, then never one. Um... How can I... Alright, where else do I need to build if there is? Yeah, so I need to expand there. For chicken. I gotta do more over there. There's a lot of stuff I got. Oh, that's still unlocked. Okay. <clears throat> All 
All right, I will build another highway for everyone eventually. But right now, I'm just trying to concentrate on that. How's our supply? I want to keep that really high. I don't want any issues in the future with Oh, sorry guys. I really need to. I need more land. Alright, so what I can do. Is... Give a second. Alright, so that's done, and then... What are you running down? 172. <coughs> Sorry guys, I have this dry cough I just can't seem to get rid of. That's not good, a bit of flooding there. Everything else seems to be pretty good when it comes to the flooding. Okay, uh, how's our water? Um, we can probably pump in one more. Accidents, okay. 
Um, at least I didn't build anything here. <clears throat> 100, oh, we're almost starting to make profit. to What kind of future does music have if it doesn't look uh -oh. to its past? Well, I say the question speaks for itself. Here on Second Moon, we know you can't move forward unless you keep both eyes steadily trained on what's behind you. A housing shortage is driving up prices in the area. That's right, Linda. But apparently, that's not all good news. We're joined today by an expert guest, Professor Nutbutter. Welcome, Professor. So a housing shortage is bad for the people trying to move here, right? Humans are programmed to desire certain representations within... Ah, uh, I gotta connect the roads. Um... Which are entirely apart from the actual uh, rewards in nice. For example, consider capital. One, right, one final question, Professor. Is the housing shortage going to make me richer? By certain metrics, perhaps yes, in the short term. I like the sound of that. But what we are discussing is the study of a statistical abstraction and its effect on the human Thank psyche. you, Professor. It is a question of priority. Oh. And on to our main feature story. The commercial district is booming, as the area is attracting more high-end stores, bringing the latest in luxury to our neighborhood. Build five you signature bills in senior city. Well, I've done that before, but thank sipping you. a fancy local Jarvan <clears throat> Mate, or so my wife tells me. That's good for business, and good for the community. Thanks, Jim. We'll be back after this. Ah, oh, so much in this community I gotta fix. How is the fire not there yet? Come on, put the fire out. So I saved. Oh no. Actually, I have to build one more. All right. Now I'm at 338. It's it's like it's between 100. I cannot seem to like make any money. It's kind of annoying. Um,
guess it's not good. Um. <laughs> How's our water? Not enough for train. Look. Ah, oh. uh, we need more power. <clears throat> Two fifty nine. I don't. some parking. Should help with this build building. Oh no, I gotta sneeze, guys. Sorry. Ah. High taxes. I don't know. Because I gotta want to build a train yard eventually. Oh, I got it almost.
Perfect. I don't know. I might create some accidents. Oh, well, cars will just have to adjust properly. They won't care about that much in the game. Future development, everyone. Future development. Um, Two, just give me a Kit Kat. Always with the nice buildings. his home. Why would you put your bike there? <coughs> Ployer is dry dream so he lives in one of those buildings. Um the demand for this is too real. Driving advisory has been issued for the immediate area due to poor road conditions. Please exercise caution if you must drive and try to stay off the streets until conditions improve. This has been a local public service announcement. You're tuned in to Second Moon, the channel where the classics never grow old. 
Industry in the region is on the rise, and when business is doing well, that floats our boat. There's no sinking this boat, Glenda. This just in from traffic. If you're thinking about hitting the streets, you can expect delays Oops. on the major roads, especially during rush hour. Good to know, Jim. Seems like everyone is in a hurry to get somewhere fast. It's worth slowing down. I should do some more districts, but can, uh, plan your right, trip outside the rush. Oh, I don't know. I'd rather wait an hour in traffic than to have to start thinking about everything. So I really want to start Besides, to make money that, eventually. I want school education to increase. <clears throat> Actually, let's do it. Best internet, amazing educated. All right. that field. Well, we're getting there, slowly. How do I increase the... Point two percent unemployed. losing money but we're gaining we're gaining money somehow
Any other buildings need? Rent is too high, yeah, yeah, whatever. I'll just have that fast forward button. Fall. Yes, that's good. What about water? Uh, I'm trying to hold off on building, but. Do they work in the night? <coughs> How do you not feel safe at night? There you go. Now I'm no now I'm a more debt. Thank you. get up out of busy town big town that's all well, that's what I'm hoping I mean money, I will do that. Well, now we just play the waiting game. Where? I got more police. What more do you want? Still fall though. Like I said, we're not doing really much. We're just... Want to keep that electricity going.
Alright, um... the next one though? Ten. So we got one, two, three. For sure. One another bridge somewhere around here. Because I think I can get another boat thing going on so I can put a boat there. Come on, guys, we're almost there. So I just want to get off. A driving advisory has been issued for the immediate area due to poor road conditions. Please exercise caution if you must drive, and try to stay off the streets until conditions improve. This has been a local public service announcement. Second Moon Radio with your host, J. Thomas Hornbuckle. Tune in tomorrow for a second chance to hear the music of yesteryear. A housing shortage is driving up prices in the area. That's right, Glenda. But apparently that's not all good news. We're joined today by an expert guest, Professor Nutbutter. Welcome, Professor. So a housing shortage is bad for the people trying to move here, right? Humans are programmed to desire certain representations within ideological reward structures, which are entirely apart from the actual rewards enjoyed. For example, consider capital. One, right, well, one final question, Professor. Is the housing shortage going to make me richer? By certain metrics, perhaps yes, in the short term. I like the sound of that. But what we are discussing is the study of a statistical abstraction and its All right, let's get rid of those abandoned Thank buildings. You, Professor. It is a question of priority. We're we're live um, and we're getting reports about a traffic accident uh, somewhere, somewhere in the city. Uh, in the city, road maintenance services have already been dispatched and traffic flow <coughs> should return to normal. But if you're planning a quick trip out, you might want to wait a little while until everything clears up. If you're in it, you uh, you already know about it. No use reminding. Oh you. come on! Meanwhile, uh, expect delays and drive safe. I'm basically there, so let's just. Do that. <clears throat> what? Are you serious? Fine. Two forty nine. We get there eventually, I suppose. Um, we're going to give yourself a nice little end of the road. Thing. How about this? We do a district. And there we go. We finally made a big town. That's the whole point. So I'm going to end it here, and I hope you guys have a good day and a good evening.